Sleep paralysis versus sleepwalking. What's the difference? Ever wondered about the spooky side of sleep? Let's break down sleep paralysis versus sleepwalking. But first, what's REM sleep? It stands for rapid eye movement. It's your main dreaming stage where your brain is super active, but your body is temporarily paralyzed so you don't act out your dreams. Now, sometimes the wires get crossed. That's where sleep paralysis comes in. Your mind wakes up, but your body is still in that REM paralysis mode. The result? You're fully conscious but can't move a muscle. It's often terrifying and can come with scary hallucinations. Think mind awake, body asleep. Sleepwalking is the total opposite. This happens during your deepest, non-dreaming sleep. Your body wakes up and starts moving around, but your conscious mind is completely offline. You might walk, talk, or even eat, but you'll have zero memory of it in the morning. Think, mind asleep, body awake. So, one is a conscious mind trapped in a paralyzed body. Sleepwalking is an active body directed by an unconscious mind.